What's up YouTube, welcome back again, it's your buddy Technoboy and uh, what you're seeing now is a power bank and you can see it's written here Samsung and so many things at the back made in Korea uh, but the fact is this is not at all a Samsung even it is not at all a good power bank because I bought it from a railway station and it was much cheaper uh, than you can expect like uh, 150 or something I think I know and I bought that long back just to test uh, how they are even if they are good or bad or no I am having this since long time so why I'm telling you this because if you have this kind of thing you can upgrade that yes you heard me right because in a, this kind of thing you will see that uh, it cannot even charge a 50% of uh, your mobile phone or maybe laser than that so when I opened this thing I saw three cells are there so I thought maybe really three cells are there but it was not uh, actually inside there's a place for three cells only 18650 3.7 volt battery and uh, three cells were there definitely but, but uh, both side the, those two cells were totally fake there were sands inside uh, that and uh, only at the middle one cell one cell was there but that was maybe even 500 mh or maybe lesser than that so the fact is it was totally useless but I uh, made it useful so first of all let me open this there it is you can see three cells are there well that's the thing that's I want to show you that these are my old uh, laptops battery uh, with the laptop was dead and the uh, battery was not so good so I opened that battery casing and found this three actually I found four batteries were good they were having around 3.5 volts so I thought I can use that so I connected three batteries Here you can see parallelly and this is the B minus you can see and this is the B plus battery so that's it and now it's uh, working fine uh, I mean these are also old batteries but at least they can charge one mobile completely so that's a good thing uh, you can see these are 18650 battery from Sony and uh, I think they are having more than 1000 mh of capacity so what you need to do is you can easily identify this is the negative side this big plate will be there and the top side the positive side you can see the tiny plate and other part will be covered up so that is how you can identify the positive side and the negative side of this kind of battery if you don't know in case you don't know so I'm telling you that so what you need to do is you uh, need to get a good copper wire a, I, have, I used a thinner wire but you better use a thicker wire to get the ampere properly so you just need to parallelly connect it, the battery so all the positive terminals will be on one side you can see this one from to this one and from this one to this one and this one to the battery positive here and from here this one to this one to this one all the negative and this black wire to this battery negative here so that is it A anyone can do it who has the basic electronics knowledge and can uh, uh, do the shouldering so that's it that's how you can use uh, if you have any old uh, power bank or any cheaper 
a fake power bank just like this or even any other power bank whose battery has died so that's it that uh, I wanted to show you and uh, hope you are gonna like the video thanks for watching see you in the next video bye bye